Dave Snyder here. It is October the 14th, 2012. Okay, just wanted to show you what I think created the Rocky Mountains. Okay, so are you ready for this? Probably not. Okay, here you go. This is what created the Rocky Mountains, right here. This impact by the moon. Mare Oriental reversed over the Earth. This is reversed image. You have to flip it over to put it over the Earth. Okay, this is larger than, than it is on the moon, for sure. But the way that I found this, aligned this to this spot, was with the weather. I did not align this to the land. I aligned this to the weather. But the weather patterns that were there that day, when I, fa when I found it, about three weeks ago, probably. I'd say three weeks ago, I, I put this, I made a video, uh, uploaded a video about this overlay right here. When I, when I discovered it while I was making a video, because there was a weather pattern right here, right here in the spot that I used to line it up. And then when I removed it, removed the weather and checked it with the land, this is how it fit. Like this. Just like that. Now we'll go through the go through it in detail. And this would push up the Rocky Mountains, I would think. Right there's the edge. I mean, look, right here. There's the Rocky Mountains. Right on the edge. The land changes right at that ring. Right here. Right there at that ring. Okay, and then you got all this up here. You got this angle here that comes across this line there. You have the same thing, Canada, right there. See that? Same angle, exact same angle. See this right here? I don't know if you can see that or not. But see this area here? It's the same thing you see right there. Same thing. You can see these mount where these mountains were. You can see everything fit beautifully. You see this big crater right here with the big uh, map. Uh, I don't know what you call that in the center. See that hits right there, or it, probably, it may maybe it may be Yellowstone. Maybe that's where it, it hits Yellowstone because it's really close to that. Creates Yellowstone, maybe. See that big the big crater right here, the big mound in the center. Okay, this is where the center of the impact is. Great Lakes creates the Great Lakes. All the salt mines that are un underneath all the Great Lakes and all the salt that's in the area. All the salt. This is what creates the salt because the moon hits right there and it creates a big hole in the earth just about the size of the hole that's in the moon right there that you see I would imagine because this fits perfectly this is there's the Gulf of Mexico you can see Sh whole shape of Gulf, the Gulf of Mexico you can see that the continent where the continental shelf is made right here it, I mean you can do this yourself anybody can do this this is an image you can get off the internet of Mare Oriental reverse it and it it, it shapes the whole planet this, this crater shapes the whole planet. Whether it, you, look, it sounds crazy, as crazy as you, you think it sounds crazy, but if you don't get, look into it, you're going to miss out. You really are. Because it's the, truth of the, it's the truth of the planet. It is the truth of our planet. This is the source of our, our world right here, this, this crater on the moon. Shapes everything. You can see it. It shapes everything. Look at this whole western United States. Right there. Look at that. All of Mexico, all of Canada up there. I mean, all all of America, all of America. South America hits about eight times around. South America is a big impact itself. A, bunch, a couple of them. One down here, one right here. One, at least one right here. One right here for sure. This is the center of another Mare Oriental impact right here. Center of another one. Same crater. Yep. Believe it or not. I know most people won't believe it, so and you're going to miss out, too. This is true. I mean, look, at if these images are really of the moon, then that's the truth. There's no way around it. Like I said, I lined it up with the weather. I, you can watch the video on, on my channel. You should watch it, all the videos I got on my channel to see how, because I, I skip around a lot. I don't make my videos very well organized, and you can see. Look at that. Look at the whole eastern seaboard right there. See that? Look at look at how it, it's just open right there. It comes, it just fits right to there, right to there. Everything's in place. Every angle is the same. You can see this right here creates this right here. The whole plateau probably right there. Look at that. Pushes up the Rocky Mountains for sure. So that's how the Rocky Mountains are created.
or at least one of the ways it is created because the moon impacts more than one time apparently I mean from my research I've been doing this for three years reverse image overlays of the moon's surface over the earth and I can tell you with this crater I've found just about everything and they all link themselves together when I when I, I put another one over here it'll overlap and it'll fit the, the, the features will match all the time so there's a lot of impacts that happen here Mer this is obviously an impact the uh, Marianas Trench obviously an impact I had a good this one here in the Indian Ocean definitely an impact show you that had that had some good weather there yesterday and uh, it's really good okay so this is lined up this is aligned perfectly in, in India this look at look at this, this is what shapes India right here look at this right here on the moon let me just show you without the borders here okay you see see this area right here look at that completely shapes India this hits right here in the Indian Ocean I, I, I guarantee it does do the research yourself you'll see I mean you can comment if you want and say that say that it's all stupid but if, if you don't if you don't look into it you're gonna miss out I'm telling you right now this, unless somebody made these images to, you know to do this but I, I couldn't see how they could predict my every move I don't see how they could do that so Anyways, we'll go over this one right here. With the, let's see what the weather looks like today. If it's anything like yesterday, it fits real good. Oh, there's no weather today. Hard, hardly any. But it, what's there? Oh, that's weird. Weird weather day. Still fits. Hmm. Really, really lack of weather there today. Looks like. Anyways. Likes to hit the poles. So apparently, where it hits most of the time was probably a, a pole at one time. This was probably at the pole, one of the poles, one time, and pretty much all the ones that I show were probably at the pole at one time. This one here, this is probably at the pole at one time, and some of them are the same impact. Some of them are are the same impact that I'm matching up in one place in in another place because of the, the way that the continents were together at the time. So, anyways. Wanted to show that. I line that up with the weather. You watch the video. It's I don't remember. What, I think it's called uh, I don't know the, what creates the Grand Canyon and the Great Salt Lake or something like that. Where I, I first showed this one, something like a couple before that actually. I've been show, I showed a bunch of videos on this one right here. This is the uh, Great Lakes one. Great Lakes impact. So it creates the Great Lakes. It creates the Rocky Mountains. Creates America basically shapes America the way as we know it today shapes America and that's I'll just leave it at that alright have a good day